Hey guys, Wizite here and welcome to the start of the Gamescom vlogs. It's, I don't even know, morning, it's Tuesday morning. Um, I've had three hours sleep because I've been up all night prepping videos for you guys, uploading them, scheduling them. So when I am in Gamescom in Germany there, I can have uploads for you guys. But nonetheless, though, I'm going to bring you guys with me. I'm going to show you guys what we get up to. I'm going to hopefully capture loads of Destiny for you guys. I'm hopefully going to be able to take you guys around Destiny booth, Halo booth, uh, Call of Duty, Gears of War, like all of that good stuff. I'm bringing you everywhere with us. My car is actually downstairs now. It's that silver Mercedes there. I can tell because there's the company name on the back of it. So we are gonna head on out, guys. And this is the start of the journey. This is a swaggy Mercedes right here. Swaggy car. Jumping on in. That there, my friends, is a wild Mercedes. Yep, you ever seen one of them before? We're at the airport. Boys, I actually think that I live somewhere like over there. I think, but anyway, let's go to the airport and see if anyone's here. Legit, I absolutely love coming to the airport and I love flying and I love going on these trips because you get to hang out with all your friends and play video games. So I literally love it, and you guys are coming with us. The mini polar bear and the airport boys. So the squad, uh, oh, so. Game Riot or Scott has probably like 99.9% .9 missed his flight because of some mad traffic. So, unfortunately, Scott's not coming to Gamescom, which sucks. I was looking forward to hanging out with him. So, that's pretty crap. But the squad is here. So, we got Vic. Then we got the journalist David, Mary, and Grace up the front. And no Scott, which sucks. So, just uh, we're just popping into Harrods to go a bit of suit shopping. We're gonna buy really expensive watches. Like this one who come who comes to an airport and spends 16 grand on a watch not me that is our vehicle for the day boys i never knew that there was all this forestry in germany it's like the amazon boys we are at the xbox conference and we're in this like massive building in in the middle of cologne and like, I mean, if we take a look here, like there, there's the entrance all the way down there. So you can see how like sort of big the building is and it goes like all the way up there. But there's a little secret little area, basement down there. So we're gonna go and take a little look. So now we're downstairs, the stairs are just here. And here we have some Forza to play. Here we have some Fable, and there's Grace, hi Grace. Fable to play, which you can actually capture. You can see the rocket on the table there. We, now we have this this doorway here into the gaming dungeon. This is the ultimate <laughs> gaming dungeon, guys. And I have to talk a little bit loud because there's a lot of music in here. There's a crowd gathering in here. We're going to go through here in just a second. I just want to take you a little around here first. We've got a bar with some food and drinks. And basically in here, so it goes all the way back to those doors at the back. And then it goes left and then right and basically on each different block that, that you can see like one here one here one of them there's a different game surrounding that block so over here we have cobalt and so on and so forth so each different block has a different game now if you go through here i'm going to take you into the halo capture session and we turn into here this is the halo room this entire room is just dedicated to halo so if we come around we can see this gen here playing Halo 5 and at the moment they're actually playing the Warzone game mode which I've got a ton of footage for you guys so do look out for that on my channel very very soon. You guys being Destiny fans I'm sure that you guys will love Halo it's actually a really good game and you can actually choose different classes in this and I'm going to explain that all in the video when that comes out soon but I'm going to walk around and we're going to see if we can find the Master Chief because he was around here somewhere. So unfortunately I missed the Master Chief guys but if I do manage to find him and get a picture of him I'll upload it on my Instagram so Make sure you're following that down in the description box below. Also follow me on Twitter. So, so Vic's gonna do some, uh, some, 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 yeah, he's gonna do some cool like jumps and business. Go on, Vic. Go on. Are you ready? And one, two, three, go. Boys. So basically, if you look here, there's like cameras that go all the way around, and then when you jump, it just gets like a mad angle. The Vic's going again. Ready? One, two, three, go! Hey. Boys! One, two, three, go! Boys! Guys, day two, Gamescom. Last night, you would have seen us playing Halo at the Xbox conference and the Fan Fest 
event that we got to go to. Today, we are gonna go into Gamescom. I'm gonna go and get some hands on with Destiny. Now, I think that you guys will see this vlog before you see the new Destiny footage, so if you haven't yet seen that, keep a look out for it. I'm also gonna be playing Halo Arena, Gears of War, but I think we should start heading out and I think we should head down to Gamescom. Me and Grace uh, decided to go for a walk and we started walking towards the Xbox venue last night. Yeah. But then we realized that Gamescom isn't at the Xbox venue, so we're technically walking into like the town center. Well, you would have got a cab there if it wasn't for you. Yeah, I know, but like we're kind of lost now. We don't know where we are, and we're going towards the Xbox venue rather than the Gamescom venue, which we have no idea where it is. Grace is just like, just, just go straight, just go straight, just keep going straight, keep going straight. Well, we can actually see a cathedral that we went to last year that was inside the city center. So we're definitely heading in the right direction of the city center. <laughs> Every time I hear them play, I just want to watch them. They are literally the best street performers I've ever seen. That's my taste of music. That's creative. Man, that's sick. They are legit. So on our explorations, we've stumbled across, right? Wait for it. A shopping center, like where you can legitimately go and buy yourself a new jacket if you want, or like new jeans. And then literally on the side of the shopping center is a McDonald's. How random is that? We've made it to the Mesa Center. This is where Gamescom is. There's like four massive entrance and like a ton of massive halls with just video games, technology for gaming and PCs and all that good stuff. But we've got a slight issue. I accidentally left my ticket printout paper that I got to show them to get my ticket in McDonald's with the rubbish because I was looking for the address to give to the cab driver. So we got some negotiating to do with the people of Gamescom to see if we can just Put my name down and get my ticket fingers crossed it goes well um you guys will know soon if we get in there or not and we're in we managed to get in got our ticket here so if somebody in mcdonald's finds a gamescom pass with the name was on it then you you got lucky um i don't even know where we're gonna head first to be honest i need to go and catch some gears of war within the next hour so probably be good to find out where gears of war are um there's an entrance right there but oh, we're not going in that one. We're going to go through and outside and then on into one of the bigger buildings out there. So we're here at the Activision booth in the Gamescom Business Center. And we, me and Grace, are going to get a private viewing of the Ten King presentation. Unfortunately, I can't show it to you guys because it's like not a, I'm not allowed to do that. Um, but I can do pre uh, impressions after. Boys! Just played uh, Gears of War. Man, I haven't played Gears of War in literally... 10 years or something crazy like that so i was kind of rubbish at it but i got some footage for you guys to so look out on my channel for that as well man so so far for you guys i've got halo gears some new destiny and even more halo today in about two or three hours i'm going to be capturing halo arena for you guys so you guys have got tons of games from videos going up on my channel in the very few days if you haven't seen them already so guys today has been mad already and it's about to get even crazier so now we're over at the Halo 5 Guardians booth where we are gonna be playing. I gotta talk really loud because there's this thing behind me and the music's insane. So right now, I believe it's gonna be me, Benny, Vic and Ali versus four other people. And we're gonna be playing Halo competitively on this booth. There's four over that side, four seats here. And we are just literally gonna battle it out. Obviously, we're gonna be going for the win. We don't wanna lose. We don't know who we're playing yet. I'm not too sure if it's gonna be like a pre-made team or if it's just gonna be like fans standing around that are gonna jump in on it. Not too sure, but I thought we'd keep you guys along the way. I'm gonna try and get Grace to film some footage for me so I can put that in just after this. But let's see what happens, guys. <laughs> Boys and girls, we are at the Destiny Capture event. You can see behind me here, 
three massive prints. You get the Hunter, the Titan, and the Warlock. And then you've got a ton of stations here that we are able to play and we're able to capture at. So today, I've, I've played Skylanders, Gears of War, Halo. I've beat Halo Pros. We played Halo Pros for the uh, arena gameplay. And we, we, me, Ali, Vic, and Benny managed to beat Halo Pros. But now at the Destiny Capture event, unfortunately, I can't aim the camera at the screen, but I can take a little walk around. So walk down, you can see these big, like, massive flags here that have the, the Taken King logo on. We keep going down to where I'm playing at. Look who it is. Look who it is. Hey, boys! I may wonder like, what the hell are you doing? What are you doing? Are you doing? <laughs> All right, look who that is! Look who that is! Can you guys see that? Little big ogre, Bife. Who else is here? It's Keith Henry. Sorry, <laughs> he's a weirdo. That one, he's a weirdo. So this is where we're at. We're at this screen right here. That right there is Fragman Soul. That is Fragman Soul Boys. You boys, you have seen me play with him. There he is. There he is. So yeah, I can't aim the camera directly at the screen, unfortunately. So we're gonna jump. Look who that is. Look who you that can't is. Film it here. No, 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 no absolutely. Deej okay. is a troll. All right. Deej is a troll. Deej is trolling me. <laughs> boys, right. So we've been at the Destiny capture event. And you know what guys, right? Today is my birthday and I haven't said it once in the vlog because I'm not like massive on my birthday. So I just treat it just casually like a casual day. And I've gone throughout the entire day. Look, look, Gamescom's empty. It's, it's, the end of, it's the end of day one. So I've gone the entire day without even mentioning that it's my birthday. Now we've done tons today, so much. You guys would have heard how much we've done today. And we just got out of Destiny. Now, unfortunately we couldn't stay for that long purely because we have to go for dinner with Xbox, my birthday dinner, and then we have a swag boat party to go to. So Xbox have hired out this massive boat and we're literally gonna be going down the river. Got DJs there, all my, all my buddies gonna be there. So we're literally going home to the hotel now, changing and heading back out. And you guys are gonna see what we're up to now. So we didn't stay on the Xbox boat party for too long. We went for birthday meal for me and Warren is in the restaurant and we went to walk off and now we've run away and we literally hide look at the we're hiding in this alleyway from Warren so we're gonna film when Warren comes out he's gonna be like where are you guys ah! dude how the hell did you know that we was here he gave me the warning ah! <laughs> bro bro you ruined it come on Ah, oh, that's Sorry, such I, just, a I have that effect on people. Well, that was a fail. Ooh, the sun is shining today. Look at the beautiful blue skies. So we're back right now where we ate dinner last night for my birthday meal, which was in that red restaurant right there. Um, bumped into my buddy's hike and TG. Like literally, I was sitting there and I checked Twitter, and then I was like, TG tweeted saying. I'm in Germany eating Italian food and I said to the guys that we were with, like imagine if they were here at this restaurant. So I stood up and just looked around and I saw Hike's beard and I went over there and I was like, bro. And he just jumps up, grabs me, hugs me, lifts me into the air. And it was so good because it's such a coincidence that we were both in the same restaurant. And I actually hadn't seen him at Gamescom yet this year. I hadn't seen him since E3, so it's really cool. We're actually gonna hang out with him later on today, but now we just literally come into uh, this little center called Humarkt, and we just uh, had some subway and now we're gonna head down into Gamescom I'm gonna go straight for the Black Ops booth because it's the only game I haven't played that I want to play and I want to capture some footage for you guys so you guys can see so like right now we're literally gonna go jump in the cab and we head down there so we just got to Gamescom outside the building and yesterday this queue wasn't here but look how far that goes back all the way from there all the way down there Okay, so Grace just said that if you don't have a ticket, then you have to wait there to get ushered into the building to then buy your ticket. Man, I legit forgot how busy this event actually gets. So what I'm gonna do is I took a picture yesterday of the stairs, right at the top of the stairs. I'm gonna take another picture and what you guys are seeing on screen now on the left will be yesterday and on the right will be today. And you guys will see the massive difference to how a press day, which like us YouTubers get to go to, and then the public day, which if you're just like a regular, and then the public day, which means like anybody can go to. So we're in the business center because the, the halls are just ramped. You guys already seen the picture 
Um, and basically, so yesterday I missed my appointment with Valve to try their new VR, like the uh, virtual reality um, like game that you, that you put on your face and that you can look around. I missed my appointment. So what we're going to try and do is we're going to try and head over there now to reschedule it for now. And you guys, like, if we manage to do that, you guys are going to see me play it. I'll include some game footage and the footage of me like looking around so you guys can see that as well. But I don't know if it's going to be possible because it's like the public day, so it's going to be so rammed with so many people. But fingers crossed that they'll let us do it. So the Valve thing fell through. I couldn't, I couldn't actually uh, go and capture that. All their slots were full. So what we're going to do is I'm actually going to go to Valve offices. But what I did do is I came down to the Activision booth. So behind me here is Black Ops 3. If I thought I'd just take a quick tour of the Activision booth. So here's Black Ops 3 in there. Just been playing that. Um, it looks like an interview is about to happen over here. So I'll just quickly show you. This is the Destiny booth. Right here. And if we keep walking around, we have Skylanders in there, which is actually really, really fun. I didn't, I didn't know what it was. And then when I played it, it was really, really fun. So basically how it works is you get this, it looks like a mouse map, right? And then you get these, so these are the vehicles. And then these, and then these guys are the characters in the back there. And what you do is for each character you buy, you get a vehicle and then you put the character on like this mouse mat. It's called a portal, but it's almost like a mouse mat. You put it on that and then in inside the toy, it has like a code or like a barcode sort of thing, like a reader. And then that then puts the character and the vehicle in game. So you put them on. That's a really cool idea. I, I, somebody said the right term for it, but I literally can't remember. So that's Skylanders, Destiny in there. We keep walking around here. We have Guitar Hero. You guys are gonna love this. You guys are gonna love this, right? So if you come over to here, these are all of the games that they have. Look at that, my friends. Look at that. Boys, big plays. So you've got the uh, the legendary edition there. You've got the box here. You got like the little DLC codes here. Unfortunately, they're not on the back of that though, so you guys won't be getting them soon. I may do a giveaway at launch. Let me know in the comment section if you'd like a giveaway at launch. Actually, It'd be really cool. Um, you've got all of that, the Guitar Hero stuff right here. These guys are like having a tour about that. But yeah, so that's pretty much the Activision booth. We just decided to venture into the unknown of the public day at Gamescom. Guys, check it out. So all behind me is like mad loads of people. And in front of me is mad loads of people as well. Not so just headed down to the Xbox booth and there's literally like tons of people here. Like all, all these guys here. Uh, so here you have Minecraft, here's Quantum Break, um, if you keep walking through, you got Tomb Raider, we're, we're, we're gonna take a whole look at on the entire booth anyway. Um, so this is all, this, all this, all this station here is all for the new Windows 10 that literally launched like a week ago. There's Tomb Raider, and there's like a ton of people with Tomb Raider. Uh, this game right here, I believe is FIFA, is this FIFA? FIFA? Yeah, this one's FIFA. Um, and they don't have one booth, they have two. So over here we have Fable Legends. Then you got Gigantic, Cuphead, Forza 6. I literally, there's tons of games, tons of people here as well. So here's what the Elite Controller looks like from the front. And basically, all of these buttons, the, the, the sticks are interchangeable. Here's the back, so you got your paddles. And then you got the switches to turn the trigger stops on and off, so that's really cool. Gamescom 2015 is over for me. There is a day tomorrow where people can come back, but we fly at like 1 p.m. So everybody's literally leaving right now. Another successful year. Captured loads of games for you guys. Um, you may not have seen them just yet, but you will see them soon. We're not done in Germany though. We still have tonight. So we're gonna go out, gonna go meet everyone. Obviously it was my birthday yesterday and we're gonna go celebrate that tonight with like everyone, with squad. Today is Friday and we are already at the airport guys. Unfortunately I didn't vlog last night, I completely forgot to do it. We just went out and met up with a load of guys and it just literally slipped my mind. But I just wanna say thanks to everyone for the support of my videos since I've been here. You guys are great. Uh, look out for Halo, Skylanders, Hopefully Black Ops. They didn't get to capture Black Ops, but I might be able to get some footage off the other YouTubers. Uh, some new Destiny content coming out. Oh man, it's been a great Gamescom. Flying back home. Thank you to Xbox and Edelman for bringing us out. You guys are great, and we'll see you guys next time.